and welcome to the Auction Transportation Playbook video series. Today we're going to talk about the structure of online orders. For an order to be entered into the system correctly, the following fields are required. 1. Customer field. Includes the customer information as related to the record. 2. Pickup location includes all the contact information of the pickup location, including hours of operation. Three, drop location, includes all of the same information as the pickup location, except for this is the drop off location. Four, load notes. These notes are for internal use only. These notes are to track and communicate any changes, updates, and or problems with the progression of the order. Any changes and or updates made to the order should always be included in a load note. Each new note is added to HQ2 and will reflect time, date, and user ID. 5. Transport order notes. These notes are for the carrier after they have agreed to take the load. They will not be able to see these notes until the unit has been assigned to them. They should include any drop hours, contacts, phone numbers, and operable reasons, or any other important directions or information pertaining to the pickup or drop-off of the unit in which they are transporting. 6. Pre-dispatch notes. These notes are for the carrier before they take the load. They should include any important information the carrier needs to know before they agree to transport the unit. It's important to never put contact names, emails, or phone numbers in pre-dispatch notes. This concludes part one of two parts on understanding the structure of an order. Thank you, and we'll talk to you soon.